Hi guys and welcome back to some more of the crew wild run or well, actually the crew because we're not actually featuring any wild run vehicles in today's video we've, we've, we're adding to the garage again now I wanted to get another Perth car now I've already got a skyline that's pretty well, good and well upgraded and I went to the uh, garage and I saw this car the rough CTR free now this car I'm not, I've never never driven one of these on many games so i think the only other game I've, I've had a go in one of these is project cars but it was only briefly so i wanted to try this out in two different kinds of races so i've selected two fraction races one's going to be around a windy roads sort of in the desert area and the second one is going to be around the snowy mountains so that's going to be really interesting it may be total chaos i'm trying to build up this series i hope you enjoy the videos and please please leave comments please leave your likes i'm only a small youtuber so those sort of things really matter i'm 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 really trying to build this channel up i hope you enjoyed what i've done already please let me know your um what your feelings on this channel in the comments right let's get straight into the racing and <laughs> see what this car's like Right guys, so in this first race I've chose a circuit which is really tight and windy. Hopefully we can see what this car's like um, handling round corners. It's really tight, it should be really challenging. But uh, let's see what this car's like. But the car isn't totally upgraded, it's up to 1,207 so it's pretty close. But uh, yeah, I just want to start building the garage. So you've got a different variety of cars for different races because not every perf race is perfect for every perf car now hopefully this will be better for this sort of vehicle and as you can see that sort of vehicle is not great around a circuit like that and as you see it's spun out and again another one so um, hopefully I've chose the perfect car we will see two laps of this and we're in third place at the moment but um, I also am um, racing in this view I, I find it a lot better it's a bit more realistic and it gives you a better well, I just find it easy to go around corners. You can get in the right positions around the corners in this view. And you can judge the speed a bit more as well. But let me know if you want to see me racing different views. I'm always up to trying new things. But I do, like I said, I do a lot of racing games on my channel. I mean, I'm still doing a Need for Speed walkthrough. I do project cars and I do a lot of motor motorbike uh, games as well. So my channel is uh, very much should I say a racing channel although I do do other walkthroughs as well which I hope you enjoy and like Fallout 4 Battlefront but uh, majority of what I do is racing so I hope if you subscribe um, I hope you like what I do but it'd be nice to uh, get to comments and uh, let me know your opinions I mean I've been doing this for almost a year now I'd like to push this channel forward if I can and really concentrate on certain games if that's what you want to see Right, let's try and win this race. We're on the second lap. And this hasn't been bad so far for my first experience in this car. If I can finish this race and win. God, it has got quite good straight line speed. Look at that, nearly 190. God, on a circuit like that, that's absolutely crazy. Got a couple more corners. Oh, I did that one a bit fast, didn't get the brakes on. So we're coming up to the finish line. This would be excellent. So yes! So we get a win in this car first out, that's not bad. Now that car being, because it's so low, it uh, has a good cornering speed and it was really good around a circuit like that, I was well impressed. Now the next race is really going to test it. What's this car going to be like in snowy conditions? That's the thing, it's going to be absolutely crazy, well it's pretty insane really. But we're going to jump into the next race and see what it's like. I hope you enjoyed that first race and I hope you enjoy the second one, so here we go. Right, so here we go in our second race, and uh, the name of this race is called Slip and Slide. And that's pretty much what we're probably going to do. This is going to be absolute chaos. Trying to get eight cars around these sort of roads in snowy conditions is just absolutely insane. But we're going to go and try this. So here we go. Let's try and get a good start. There's some really fast cars in this race. We've got a Lamborghini there. I don't know how that's going to get around this... Uh, race but uh, that's the car that that person chose right let's try and get around this first corner is gonna this is gonna be just oh my god oh straight into an oncoming traffic car there's gonna be a lot of I expect there's gonna be a lot of crashing in this race so I do apologize but just trying to get the grip the wheels are spinning like anything 
it's this is one that you're going to have to use your nitros to, uh, when you lose control just to get you back on track but i'm going to try my best um I've, I've done this race once before ages ago but i can't remember what car i did it in uh, but it was probably early on when i had the crew but some of these fraction races are absolutely brilliant i mean some of them are really long as well some like well over an hour um, I don't think uh, you would want to see... Oh, God, lost control there. I don't think you would really want to see me do one for over an hour, but I could do one and just break up the best bits. Um, it'd be a bit of fun. Or you can, but now you can make up your own races and challenge people across the map. We're definitely going to have to do that in a, in a, in a video. If uh, one of you want to have a go at that, just let me know. That would be really good fun if we could just make up our own destination and have a race in a particular car if we've got the same sort of car in our garage. I'm always up for the challenge. I mean, I'm not the, uh, the quickest on the crew, but uh, I do all right. All right, let's try and get back in this race. I'm right down the bottom at the moment. I'm really struggling in this car in the snow. Definitely not a snow car. <laughs> but any of these cars shouldn't really be this good in this sort of conditions. But I'm going to take advantage of being in the tunnel because there's no snow. And my car's quite good in a straight line. So we're up to fourth. Can we catch the uh, front uh, three here? Yes, we can. See you later. Bye bye. <laughs> and we've gone into first. It's unbelievable. Oh god. Oh, there had to be a bloody car on that corner. That could have been a complete and utter smash up there, but just meant Oh my god. Got some air time there. God dear. Try to get the brakes on. Oh, it's absolutely crazy. Trying to put the brakes on in these conditions. You just slide everywhere. It's just trying to get your car into gear. It's like once you lose the back end, that's it. You just get no traction. You're trying to boost. You're just spinning up. You can hear the engine just, just not engaging into gear. It just can't. It's just obviously with traction control, it, the, the wheels don't spin. It just goes. It's an oh shit. I'm going to have to reset that. There's me waffling on. I'm a slid straight off the circuit there. It was bound to happen. Right, I'm last at the moment. Oh, this is a. This isn't what I was expecting. I was at least trying to get in the top three. But you have to win this race, obviously, to complete it. But I can't see that happening now. But I'm going to carry on. They're all bunched up. So if I have a good last with what's four checkpoints, I might be able to get back up into the top. When we've managed to get back into fourth there. Let's try and use this uh, tunnel again to catch up. Up into third. Oh, God. Oh, that was close. Is there going to be another jump through this tunnel? Hey, God dear, this car absolutely flying. Nearly 190 miles an hour on an icy road. Now that is an absolute insane thing to do, but we are doing it. But we cannot get the grip around these corners. So slow. I just can't see us catching the first, the, uh, first and second until we can get some traction. We need to stay on the road. Got, we've only got three more tre checkpoints. If we can just stick to the road and catch up. Otherwise, uh, this race is going to be over. Right, so that's... Hopefully this last bit of the race isn't too difficult. Oh, they've smashed up. So I've taken the lead. That was absolutely perfect. Only two more checkpoints to go. That uh, oncoming car done me a favour. But uh, that's still there's still quite a way to go. So there's still time for me to cock it up. Hopefully I won't. So that's slowed down a bit there. Damn, it's so hard to stop on the on this road. It is so icy. Oh, damn on the snow there. Get off. Right, we've only got two more checkpoints. They're just behind me. They've caught up again. This is going to be a fight to the finish. Can I do it? Oh, this looks tricky, this section. Oh, hold it, hold it. Tight. Oh, so I've only got a, just over a second lead. Right, just trying to use the night trust. And again, see, just look, I can't get any grip. Can't get any grip. It's not accelerating. It's accelerate. Oh, God. Only just. Right, we've only got one more checkpoint. Can we finish this race and win it? Oh, this would be absolutely amazing. It's considering I was in eighth place at the start of the race and I came off the circuit as well. So we just come through the tunnel. Are we going to win? Yes. So we get a second win in this episode. I cannot believe that I won that race. It was absolutely crazy. But I did get a little help from some of the on 
oncoming traffic, but you've got to take your chances in this race. I ain't going to complain. And if there's any other cars in Perth Edition that you've got on the crew that, that are absolutely brilliant and I, and you think I should give a go, let me know in the comments below so I can give them a go. I want to build up my garage. I'm really enjoying this game with all the new DLC and the enhancement on the graphics. Please let me know and I will see you soon for some more crew. Thank you very much and bye.